It's a mission to go where nothing from Earth has gone before, but it's going to be hot, very hot. We have this special uh, uh, heat shield, it's going to be around 5 inches thick, and that thing is made of a special materials, carbon fibers and some special foams, and that keeps the outside of the spacecraft at 2500 Fahrenheit and the inside at room temperature. This is the Parker Solar Probe and is part of NASA's Living with a Star program. The $2 billion project is aimed at getting the small spacecraft to within 6 million kilometers from the Sun. It might not seem very near, but it's still seven times closer than what any other ship has managed in the past, given that the Sun is around 150 million kilometers from Earth. And what it means is that if you think about the distance between Earth and the Sun to be 100 yards, we're going to be, or a football field, we're going to be at the four yard line. We're going to be very, very close. We're going to be actually touching the particles of the Sun. The solar probe is set to be launched on the 11th of August for a seven year mission. If successful, it'll enable scientists to see storms developing in the Sun and how they can impact Earth. We can better predict the space weather, as we call it, in, of our planet and also the geostorms and see if we can protect our communication satellites and also learn about our climate too. The closest previous pass to the Sun was in 1978 when the Helios 2 probe came to within 43 million kilometers from the Sun's surface. Giris Saulani, ABC News.